Hi, this is Darren Chow from DarrenTips.com. In this presentation, I'm going to share with you the things that you probably want to know before you go on and create a website. It will be things like what are the key components you need in order to build a website, how much they will cost you per year, and how long it takes to set up a website. Now, this will be a short presentation just to give you an overview of the big picture. In the next few tutorials, I will guide you step by step on how to create a website like DarrenTips.com. So, don't worry if you are completely new to website creation because I'm going to make everything as simple as possible. Now, let's look at the first point of this presentation. What are the key components to create a website? Now, in order to create a website, you will need at least three things. A hosting service, a domain, and a website template. Now, you need hosting service to host your website files so they are connected to the internet. And people around the world can get access to your website at any time. A good way to understand your web hosting is to actually imagine your website as a real physical shop which actually occupies space and you need to pay rent for the space every month if you own the shop. Now this is similar to web hosting. You need to pay for your web hosting service every month because the hosting company gives a certain space for you to actually put your web files to help you to connect to the internet all time. I know it might be a little bit confusing for you if you heard about it the first time. Don't worry <laughs> if you don't quite get what I said. You just need to take it as you know, renting a virtual space so that you can put your web files, right? Now the second thing you need is a domain name. A domain name is basically the address of a website on the internet. For example, DarrenTips.com is the domain name of my website. So when you type in DarrenTips.com and search in the browser, you will find my website. To build a website, you need to purchase your own domain name. If you can imagine paying for hosting just like paying for the shop space you rent, then you can as well imagine paying for a domain name. It's just like paying for a registered name of your shop. Alright, now next, uh, we are going to talk about website templates. Website templates would determine the feel and the look of your website. Now, there are a few ways uh, how you can actually go on and build your website. You can design your own website by using software like Dreamweaver or Composer, the free tool, or you can also use the site builder provided by your hosting company to design one, or you can use scripts or templates which is already designed by other people. So if you just get started out and you know nothing about website design, then I suggest you to use existing templates because I believe that that's the easiest way to actually set up a website. In the following tutorials, I will show you how to use WordPress platform to create a website from scratch. It is very, very easy. Just follow whatever I click and you will have your own website set up in no time. There are many good looking and useful WordPress themes out there and most of them are free. So just go ahead and Google free premium WordPress themes and you will see a lot of themes which you can use as a template for your website. Basically these are the three things you need in order to create a website. Next, I think you are interested in how much will this cost. Now, a hosting service will cost you around $8 per month and that's about $96 per year. All right. A domain name will cost you around 5 to $10, depends on what is your top level domain. And the last one, website templates will cost you nothing if you use the free ones. So in total, having a website will cost you around you know, $9 per month. This is just an estimate figure. You can actually get your website set up with cheaper price. I will show you how in next tutorial. Now let's go to the last questions. How long does it take to set up a website? Well, it depends on how much you've already known about setting up a website and how technical are you. If you're a completely new uh, person, no prior experience and you're not a technical person yourself, I think that you'll be able to actually set up a website in less than two hours, provided if you follow my tutorials carefully. When I said set up, it does not mean uh, it does not include the content creation part of your website. It is only up to the point where you have your own domain name and people can access, can get access to your website online. So 
I think this is all you need to know about setting up a website. Now, one last thing I, I want to add here is that setting up a website is not a difficult task. Once you go through it the first time, you can you can do it very fast for the second time and so on. Now. When I set up my first website, I spent a whole day trying to accomplish it. But now I can set up a website in less than 15 minutes because I already know how to do it. Now I'm sure you do not need a whole day to set up a website, just like my first time. This is because my video tutorials will show you step by step on how to create a website. You will need to follow whatever I do. Uh, you just need to follow whatever I do and click whatever I click and you can have your own website set up and running in no time You do not need to waste time to figure out how to do it yourself, right? So that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Darren Chow from DarrenTips.com Looking forward to see you again in the next tutorial